St. John of Capistrano. Feast Day, October 23rd. The Extraordinary Journey of St. John of Capistrano. In the small Italian town of Capistrano, in the year 1385, a child was born to a French or possibly German knight, but fate had different plans for young John. His father's life was cut short, leaving him an orphan at a tender age. Guided by his resilient mother, John's path would lead him through unexpected twists, from the courts of law to the altars of faith, ultimately culminating in a heroic stand for Christianity. John's mother was determined that her son would receive a proper education. After mastering Latin, he pursued studies in both civil and church law in the city of Perugia. His intellect and integrity quickly propelled him into the role of the city's governor at the young age of 26. It seemed as though a promising political career was unfolding before him. However, destiny had other plans in store. In 1416, when a war between Perugia and the House of Malatesta erupted, the nobles imprisoned John. In the solitude of his cell, he began to question the path he had been following. It was during this moment of reflection that John experienced a life-changing dream, a vision of St. Francis of Assisi. This dream would mark the turning point in his life. With unwavering determination, John chose to embrace a life of poverty, chastity, and obedience and sought to join the Franciscan order. He abandoned his possessions and his social status to follow the calling of his heart. In October 1416, John officially became a Franciscan. Guided by the teachings of his mentor, St. Bernardine of Siena, known for his bold preaching and devotion to the name of Jesus, John ventured into the world as a deacon in 1420. Five years later, he was ordained as a priest. His life as a preacher had just begun. John's devotion and faith were unshakable. He found himself defending St. Bernardine from charges of heresy, proving the purity of their shared way of devotion. Yet, in his efforts to mend internal disputes within the followers of St. Francis, John encountered challenges that tested his resolve. The Church recognized John's abilities and entrusted him with crucial missions. Among them, his role in the Ecumenical Council of Florence, where he worked tirelessly to bridge the divide between Eastern and Western Christendom. His efforts, however, would extend far beyond the Council's walls. As John journeyed through Italy, his preaching drew immense crowds. He was not limited to his homeland, he ventured into Central Europe as well. There, he boldly confronted the theological errors of the Hussites, particularly their views on the Eucharist. The year 1453 brought a seismic shift in the world's balance of power. Constantinople fell to the invading Turkish forces, sending shockwaves through Christendom. Pope Nicholas V recognized the need for urgent action and called upon John to rally European leaders in defense of their faith. John was a man of action. He joined forces with the renowned General Janos Hunyadi to defend the city of Belgrade against the advancing Ottoman forces. The priest, fueled by unwavering faith, led a section of the army in a historic battle on August 6, 1456. The victory at Belgrade was monumental, but it came at a great cost. Janos Hunyadi, weakened by the campaign, succumbed to illness shortly after the battle. John, however, survived, and it was he who delivered the funeral sermon for the fallen general. Yet, John's own journey was nearing its end. After a painful illness, on October 23, 1456, he passed away. His extraordinary life, marked by a transition from a life of power and privilege to one of humility and faith, left an indelible mark on history. In 1724, the Catholic Church recognized the sanctity of John of Capistrano by canonizing him. His legacy lives on, not only as a patron of military chaplains, but as a symbol of unwavering faith, 
relentless devotion, and the enduring power of the human spirit. The story of St. John of Capistrano reminds us that sometimes, the most unexpected journeys lead to the most profound destinations. Folded hands medium light skin tone embrace daily inspiration with the saints. Glowing star. Loudspeaker discover the wisdom and guidance of saints like St. John of Capistrano by subscribing to our channel. Each day, you'll receive a dose of spiritual inspiration to uplift your heart and soul. Join our community in celebrating faith, hope, and love. Sparkles here's how you can show your support. 1. Subscribe to our channel for your daily dose of saintly wisdom. 2. Share your blessings in the comments to spread positivity. 3. Share the video on your social networks and invite others to join in the inspiration. Let's unite under the light of St. John of Capistrano and be blessed with his guidance.